Hi, good afternoon, everybody. I'm so happy to see you today. You have no idea. Today's a good day. Um, right now, I am working on a white denim painted jacket for my great niece, Lorelei. And um, I've started already and just done a background here. It's got um, phalo blue and carillion blue and then teal and then a little purple and then a little more blue. Actually, this isn't carillion. That's carillion. Anyway. Um, now I'm going to work on it some more. So I'm happy to have you join me and I appreciate your company and I'm thank you for your comments and likes. Diet Coke. It's my big vice. Okay. Here's my, here we go. I need my palette. Oh, I organized my paints the other day and I cleaned and conditioned all my paint brushes, so I'm really happy. Easier to work now. Okay. Um. I'll use this titanium white, even though it's not great paint. And it's super messy. Get my garbage can. Oops. Peel some of this paint off of here. You see that, guys? That's a mess, huh? So I hope you're all having a good week so far. It's Wednesday. Um, you know, as good as we can feel with everything that's going on right now in the, in the country, in the world. But you've heard enough about that. You've seen enough about that. I'm not about that today. I'm just about painting. So let's relax and paint together, shall we? Putting some white paint on my palette. Okay. Well, enough of that. Um, more white paint coming up. And this is better paint. It's Liquitex Heavy Body Acrylic. This is my favorite paint that I've ever used. Um, I love the thickness, the viscosity of it. It's really beautiful. Okay, I need a little bit of that. And I need some unbleached titanium, which is a white without being bleached. It's kind of a nude color. A little fleshy. Well, my fleshy, anyway. Let's see? I'll show you all my colors up close when I'm done. And maybe a little bit of warm gray. This is a neutral gray value number five. It looks like a warm gray to me. And maybe a little blue. Just a little bit of this color left and I, I think it'd be nice to pick it up. There we go. This is called light blue violet. So the other day, I'm going to do it later, but I found a denim jacket for my puppy. <laughs> and it is so cute. And I'm going to paint him a jacket. And I'm going to paint matching one for me because, you know, I'm crazy like that. Okay. Need to add some GAC 900 just to make this stay and not wash off in the wash. that in. See, I have my titanium white, my unbleached titanium, and then the warm gray and the light violet. Got to mix up this paint color with the
Hiroki? Wondering what I'm going to paint with these colors, huh? Angel wings. So, we're going to go up like this. And then down right here. And then right here. Right here. Right here. Bring it all the way down to there. Okay, and bring it down like this. Make those feather tips a little pointier. They're not square. Okay, and we'll do the other side. Try to make it look the same. Oops, that's a big old blob of paint. Spread that out. Use some of that paint from over here, scoop it up, put it here. Spread that paint around, it's a little thick, because that's my awesome titanium white Liquitex heavy body. My awesome. I love new paint. I got plenty of paint now. So I don't get to buy any more for a while. But I don't need to, so... I'm still waiting for my sewing machine to come in the mail. They said three weeks, so I have one more week to wait. Hopefully I'll get it by my birthday. That would be nice. And then I could start doing um, sewing embellishments on the jackets, too. If I wanted to do a little embroidery or um, sew on some lace or whatever. That's, I'm going to do all kinds of stuff. Now I'm going to take a little of the unbleached titanium and mix it with this white. Just... Um, Kind of give a little bit of shading and color and warm it up a little, you know. But we don't want to have yellow wings, so we don't want to use too much of this. little warm gray mixed with the white see what I'm doing just getting both paints on my brushes okay. 
So the more colors I have in here, you won't be able to see the variation in color as well as I can because, well, my camera just doesn't pick it all up. But it's giving shadows and depth to the wings. so excited about this jacket. My great niece is just about the cutest little girl ever. And I'm so excited that my nephew ordered some jackets for his kids because I get to make little jackets for a while. I should hold this up a little. Well, then they can't see what I'm painting. So, maybe not. I put a little bit of all the paint on there and just go for it. I need a smaller brush now. Just to make these feather tips pointier. more gray over here. Oh, it's so bright you can barely see it. Okay. But you can see the different color variations and that these wings have like um, a little depth to them. That's what we're going for. Some depth. I want shallow wings. Oh, I gotta turn some of this light off. You guys can't see a dang thing. That's just too bright. Let's see if this is better. Oh, that's better. That's better, huh? Oh, excuse me. All right, that is better. Now, I didn't use any of this lavender, so maybe I'll get a little lavender and blue in there and just here and there put a little of this pretty blue shadow. Not too much though, just a little, it's just a hint. You still can hardly see it, it's so damn bright. I'm gonna shut off that light over the top too and see if that helps. I don't want gray, I want it blue.
All right, I'm definitely going to turn off the above light and see if that helps. Hold on a sec. Well, I'm painting in the semi-darkness, um, but you can see the colors a little better now, so we'll, we'll go with that. And if it makes me paint a little more vibrantly, then that's all good. I love vibrancy. I like it. Oh, it's still frustrating that you can't see. But you can see a little. All right, now I need to use this really small brush. Not really small, but pretty small. And I'm going to make a little feather here and a little feather here. And that is the stem of the feather, which you cannot see. And then I'll take some white. I can barely see it, folks, because I'm in the dark for you. Gotta make it white. I don't know if I like that. It doesn't look like a feather. What if I use this brush? Will that make it look more feathery? Oh, absolutely. And over here. For this feather. I'll do the feather first, and then I'll do the, st the stem of the feather. Uh, I think... I don't think those ones in the middle look good. I wonder if I can take them out. You know, paint, paint is pretty forgiving. So let's see if we can do that. I'll get a clean brush, get it wet, get my Kleenex ready, see if I can wash this off. If I can't, I'll have to paint over it. Uh, I'm gonna have to paint over this, I think. Oh, yeah, I'll get most of the white off. better. Yep, yep, yep. That's better. Okay, now I want to take a little gold. So let me find my gold paint. I've got plenty. Do I have it up here? That says gold. That says gold. See? Pretty gold. Pretty gold. I just need a little bit of this. I probably didn't even need to put that much on my palette. Oh, I need some gag. Okay. nuances that you can barely see. Sorry, folks. I got to figure something out to improve my lighting on this show.
Okay. Oh, darn it all the heck. Let me try this light again. You gotta tell me if it, which is better. So bright. Maybe I gotta turn it this way some. Yikes. It's my big head. Has my big red head been in the way the whole time I've been painting? I'm so sorry if that's the case. That looks pretty good. Okay. And um, my sweet niece is a very busy little girl. And since she was a toddler, her nickname was Chaos, given to her by mother and father. Um, and so I'm going to paint Chaotic Angel up here. And then trim this out a little bit and do some more and we'll see what happens. I have to decide. So time for some lettering. I want to do this really good. So I'm going to use white and a slanted brush. Get my paper plate back. Hope this brush isn't too big. All right, I got to make sure I'm spelling this right. Just because when I'm thinking very hard on my concentrating on my lettering, sometimes my spelling just goes. So, um, I'm going to write it down. Okay. Alexa, spell chaotic angel. Sorry, I don't know that. Yes, you do. Alexa, spell chaotic angel. Sorry, I don't know that one. Alexa, spell chaotic. Chaotic is spelled C-H-A-O-T-I-C. Alexa, spell angel. Angel is spelled A-N-G-E-L. Okay. Could now, you say that again? No, Alexa, stop. Boy, she's... Not the sharpest tool in the shed. Okay. Um, so the brush I had, I put right here. Bring my little paper plate palette back. C H A O T I C. I wonder if I have to do it chaotic angel or if I should do it chaotic angel. I think I'm going to have to do a top and bottom so I can make it bigger and still fit. So T H A O T I C T C Don't be ugly. That's not a good looking C. Let's fix that. C H Need more white paint on my palette. That's not the right one. Here we go. And I'm going to put a little more GAC. It's not really easy to do this on a paper plate. I should have used the little palette with the little cups. But, you know. Sometimes we don't.
H A O T I C. Chaotic. I'm going to make that look better with a smaller pen, with a smaller brush. Angel. A N G E L. A N G E L. A. N. G. Uh, stick my hand in wet paint. G. E. L. Yuck! That looks a terrible E. That's a terrible E. I don't think this was the right brush choice. So I'm gonna fix it. Chaotic Angel. Okay. Smaller brush. That's not a smaller brush. This is. My head in the way? My head's in the way. What am I gonna do? I bet my head's been in the way this whole time. I gotta reach further with my arms and keep my head back here. That's hard, but I can do it. Dripple of paint landed in here. There we go. Well, it's part of the feathers now. That one will work. I can do a little line here too. Okay. Fill in all the little holes. Um, you know where the fabric lines are. The, I gotta fill it in. Maybe I'll put a little gold around here. This gold is pretty. You can't see the gold hints, darn it all, because my lighting is garbage. You'll see when you see it, it's going to be lovely. 
I'm so cute on her because everything's cute on her. Is my head in the way? Ah, my big red head. I'm going to lean out this way. Give myself a neck ache, but, you know. It's all for the camera, baby. Chaotic Angel. Okay. Put that in the water. Now well, that part is done, I gotta think. Um, I might wanna do the back of the collar dark blue too. Um, and I'm gonna put some stars up here, I think. And... I need to wait for this to dry some because I'm getting it all over my hands. So I'm going to stop for now and come back to this later. And I'm so grateful to you all for popping in to join me today. I hope you have a marvelous week and the rest of your day goes great. And let's try and stay positive and move forward making positive changes. So, uh, Without further ado, I'm going to sign off and have a lovely day.